everyone. Hello everyone, and Mr. Droid159 here with Comrade Frickin' Jump yo. About Ward. Um, and we're back. And what are we doing? We are. We are now going to fetch the power coupling of doom to repair the med vendor of peril and purchase <laughs> a shield of valiance. Um, ooh, there's a red Actually, thing. Actually, no we're not. We're just going to get a fuse from a freaking broken down machine. <laughs> But that's that's a bit that's a bit like how IT help goes, doesn't it? It's like saying, I... ah, I shall, you know, provide you with a new router, um, <laughs> rewire the circuits, um, <laughs> stick a needle up my ass for your enjoyment, and like all they're doing is going control alt. Yeah, because you'd enjoy that, wouldn't you? Ah, <laughs> uh, you're learning too much from Adam. No, I do don't. Don't just, just before <laughs> anyone gets the wrong idea about this. Hang on, where's uh, the med vendor? Oh, right there. The med vendor's in his place because. He's too lazy to move it. <laughs> All right, fantastic. Uh, oh, I really want this this fast, dude. You're a son of a bee. <laughs> you are genuinely a son of a bee. It's a, it's okay. Don't worry about it. <sighs> son of a f bee. I know how to. I know how to uh, make it. So that you get another one. Uh, I'd, let's not let's not glitch or cheat or whatever. It's not glitching. It's called the finding another med vendor machine, which may have it. That's a glitch. But I'm, I'm I tell you sure, what, dude, I'm pretty sure that's a glitch. Okay, I tell you what. Here you go, because you're no, no, my no, no, friend. No, 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 it's it's cool. I'm not, and I'm not I respect you. No, 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 you can no, no, no. you can have it. You can have the shield. But but no, but 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 uh, but ooh, a shield. Now just give me your crappy one, that. <laughs> oh, I'm off to sell this one, mate. Ah, no, I took it off. How do I do it? How do I put it back on? Alright, what do I do? Okay. This is so cool. Look at our, look at our, like, you know, double negatives working. Reverse psychology. What are we doing? Turn in. Ah! Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> ah! I'm gonna win this race. Uh, yeah, you probably will, but and when it comes down to it, I will win the race, which is called the war. For independence, dude, no, dude, dude because Russian independent war fair, like happened a long time ago. Kill bandits, fantastic. Okay, now we get to shoot some people. Great. Well, I've already done lots of shooting with people, in game, out of game, you know. The I know. Mind you, I haven't killed anyone in quite a long time. Yeah, it gives you like the gives you like the nasty stomach bug, doesn't it? I know. Oh. It's just an unnatural feeling. Uh, I keep I keep finding myself like squeezing my trigger finger and pointing it at people and people are like wondering what the hell is this guy doing? They're like, dude, what the fuck? And I'm like, I'm trying to kill you. What's wrong with that? If only I hadn't left my gun in my other pants. <laughs> oh, they, hey, if it makes you if it makes you feel any better, I heard from a friend that um Die, motherfucker! No, um, <laughs> no. I heard from a friend that he came downstairs. Well, a friend of his went downstairs in the morning in just his underpants and found three guys robbing his house. Ooh, level up! Yoink! Whoa! Pup skags pushing me over the place. A sniper rifle and a pistol. Hang on, there's one more. Let me deal with them. Nope, there's more than one. Shit on my whistle. Come on. Give it to me. Give it to me. No, you are not allowed to hit me. Anyway, there is over here a sniper rifle and a pistol. And the sniper rifle isn't my level, so I can't use it. It's not my um, level either. On the other hand, we can sell it. Like, neither of us are sniper. Or, cars. you can keep it, and because it's not really a matter of how, how you know, we can still use it for long range. Right, fine. Do you want the pistol? Now nah, you can have it. I solely base my methods on revolvers and big guns. And big guns? Just like, you know, uh, big guns like big revolvers, like big thing, like, like rocket launchers. Mmm, uh, howitzers. Uh, oh, I didn't mean to go down here. Wait, tanks. Can... You know, the things that somehow are still classed by the American military as, um, you know, handguns. Yeah. I love oh, it. Like, I, one of the, I heard the world's a brilliant biggest, story. The world's biggest handgun is huge. <laughs> I heard a brilliant story 
this guy on a uh, helicopter in Afghanistan, and some some little uh, kind of Taliban guy kind of went, Oye! pulled out a pistol, started shooting this guy's helicopter, and this guy he he had no idea about like military stuff, yeah, and he just started going, Holy crap, we're getting shot at! Take cover! And everyone in the chopper started pissing themselves, laughing at him. He's like, Mate, calm down. We're in an armored helicopter. That is a handgun. And it's just like, oh, okay. And he explains to the guy that bullets don't even travel that far up to the helicopter. They so just he's, kind just, of... he's just looking at a guy like pointing a flashlight at him. And it's just like, help yeah, me. Basically. And um, Wait, where the bullets kind of don't even reach the helicopter. They just flop back down. But he said, oh, uh, are we, we're huh, under fire. I bet, I bet, I bet mate, our mate. gun. Yeah. Hang on <laughs> he a goes, sec. I bet our guns reach them. He goes, yeah. Blows the guy into smithereens. Oh, I need to be level 5 to use that. Damn you. Go on, smack him in the face. Thank you. Come on, let's go. Keep up. Don't be a slow coach. Oh, dude, you're taking a lot of damage there. Oh, you, you found a shield guy. Ah, oh, don't distract him because you're making him go further and it's going to make it harder for me to kill him. Alright. Oh, you killed him? Yep. Come on, mate. Yeah. I'm hearing growls. Get me away from them. Okay. Um, the growls are coming from little baby pup skags, and or, or if you. you're scared of or them, you, or you after you drank some of that coke. <laughs> Hang away, watch this guy. TK Baha. TK Baha. I want his shotgun. One more step, and it'll be your last. <laughs> I mean, who wouldn't want one of those? Uh, if this was, if this was um, Fallout, you'd just kill him and take the shotgun. Oh yeah. If this was Fallout, I wouldn't even kill him. I'd kind of like just put a grenade in his pocket and watch him just... <laughs> just like, boop! <laughs> okay, recover stolen food. Alright. I like food. Just as oh, much as I like crap. trades. How you doing there? What did you find? Okay, I just uh, beat the crap out of it. As you do. <clears throat> you see, the thing is, my guy's got big ass fists, yet he swings a sledgehammer. This makes no sense to me. Wait, are you swinging a sledgehammer when you do it? Because I, yeah, yeah. I just see you pummeling on me. Ooh, look, I'm searching through crap. Come on. Oh, good. Ooh, money. Mine. Hours, it's shared. <laughs> Lies, it's all mine. Don't lie. Don't lie. My ha my feelings is like my feelings are soft. I'm not lying. It's shared money. Can I have a loan? It's not that kind of shared money. Oh, what kind? Of, oh. And after the last time, I'm not borrowing you monies again. Hey, wait. Remind me which last time, because we've had a few last times. The debt that you owe at four floor, four stores of there, yeah, four floors of halls. Dude, you can't prove anything. All right, that was off the books. Off the books, my ass. The guy with the baseball bat came round. <laughs> yeah, hang on, let me do it. Let me kill this guy. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, the, base, the baseball bat was like, you know, that's that's a side issue, all right? That's called insurance. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, give me this ammo. Right. It's, it's also called pain. Ah, uh, tough up, man. You get used to it. Yeah, but the thing is, I don't like being mistaken for you and having my knees bashed in. Why not? Everyone else does it. No one else complains. Oh, well, that's because that's people. because they've all been silenced by having either their tongues cut out or their throats slit. Exactly. No one ever complains. So why should I be worried? <laughs> the fuck that I told them your address. <laughs> Wait, you did. Oh, you son of a bee. Oh, did you really? Did you wait? Did you tell them my? I didn't. Did you I'm no snake. Oh, okay. I was gonna ask them if you told them my address or just, my address I just, address. I just let Adam snitch instead. <laughs> I can't. I, I, that's actually quite a good idea because Adam probably works at like more of a discount price. Oh, look at this. Like, there's a bunch of. I just want to see this pup skag attacking a bandit. I just want to see how this goes. Bandit's gonna win. And of course, shoot. me, I want to intervene and mess up these people's perspectives. Yeah. Oh, 
Why did you let Adam snitch though? You know, you could, like Adam, you know, is like snitches for like nothing. You could have made some money out of that. I didn't even hear a word of that one second. <laughs> uh, where are we going to go? Grenades. Okay, that's better. Hang on, let me just turn down my volume a teeny bit. Yeah, same. I just decided to do that too. Skulls say, the, the, on volume, the volume in this, the music in this game is pretty sweet. The music in this game is pretty sweet. It's just uh, a pity that the whole um, blooming caged elephant isn't permanent. And there is some very nice weapons in here. Hang on, I'm just scouring around, taking free crap. By the way, have you revoked my four floors of whores membership? Dude, we're bromos. Of course I wouldn't do this to you. Ah, good man, good man. Okay, so what have I got here? Stick of grenades? Nah. I'm not accurate enough with my grenades to actually get them to stick. <laughs> What's this? A double anarchy? What's that? An SMG? Um, the double anarchy, it shoots f nine times four. Alright, oh, I was looking at the wrong thing. Alright, scattergun. Uh, I want, let's compare this one to the other scattergun. Uh, this one is more powerful. The other one is more accurate. Ooh, what do I want? Actually, the, the power is the power different, isn't that? So I want the SPR11. Give it to me. Alright, did you get grenades? Uh, do I need grenades? Oh, of course I need grenades. That's the purpose of this mission, right? Yeah, yeah. Got grenades. Got nades? Got grenades. Boy, you got nades. Yeah, I know, I got big nades. <laughs> right, grenades. Let me give me some grenades. I'm so bad with grenades. That's because we don't trust you with live explosives. It's Adam. Ever. Look, mate, it's Adam you shouldn't have to trust with live explosives. Have you ever seen him holding those things? It's about like he's <laughs> just pull out the pull out <clears> the pin and chuck the pin and then go, wait, guys, have you seen my grenade? The thing is though, it's like we tell him it's a five second counter and he goes, Oh, do you do you throw it on the zero? <laughs> <laughs> I haven't had that experience with him yet, thankfully. Yeah, I've, it's I've a five-second rule. I don't I've, actually know if grenades are five seconds. I, th I think I've it's more. Never like... actually, I've never actually decided to test that theory. <laughs> like you know, if you drop stuff on the floor, it's the three-second rule. Like three seconds before you're allowed to. Oh, dude, what are we doing? About, are we going this way already? Oh, sweet. Oh wait, um, no, it's this way. It's this way. No, it's not. It's this way. Oh, right, it's this, it's this way. way. Oh, it's this way. Ah. <laughs> Let's just casually running in the wrong direction. Our like sense we know what of we're doing. direction is not good. <laughs> yeah. Um. See, this is why we never rely on Marmite for directions. <laughs> Apparently, if you search on Twitter, 74% of people say positive things about Marmite. The others, not so positive. The thing is, though, how could you say anything positive about Marmite? Marmite's brilliant. What are you on about, boy? It's yeast extract. I don't care what it is. It. is. I'm Australian. We, we, do, we do this Marmite shiz. Well, I'm Russian, and... Marmite eats people. <laughs> <laughs> in in the sort of casual way that these things just happen. Yeah, because like people just go, oh, there's so uh, Marmite reaches out for it. Marmite unscrews, bites the hand off. <laughs> and just like, ah! And then the Russian advert TV cuts and go, Marmite either it loves you or it hates you. Was that an Irish accent? Oh. <laughs> oh, lazy toy. Okay, so how do we get this to work? Is it, I think it's something more like this. Hang on. In no. Soviet Russia, mom might hate or love you. <laughs> and depending on that, we decide whether to put you in gulag. And <laughs> detonate. <laughs> Boom, mother lun. Uh, But wait, comrade. Wait a sec, mate. <clears throat> wait a sec. We've come to that point where it's, oh. uh, it's, it's the end of the episode, mate. Oh, okay. But... Do not fear, we shall not be gone for long. So thank you everyone, you've been watching Mr. Droid and Comrade. Yo, um, yo. Leave a, le hey, feel free to leave feedback, someone's texting me, and, you know, see you later. <laughs> see ya.